Hello, if you want to set up your Redmi Watch 5 Active with your Android phone, first of all, you will have to start from turning on your device, selecting language. So basically, you will have to click and hold this power button when the device turns on, select language, and you will be uh, with this, you will be set up with this QR code screen. And in this time, you will have to actually move into your phone. You have to be connected to the Wi-Fi or mobile data. Open Google Play Store and get this application, Mi Fitness. When you download it, just simply open. Now accept, I mean tap start. Accept terms and conditions, the first one, click agree. And right here, you will have to choose your region. So in my case, the region was select automatically. This is the same region that you are using on your phone. But if you have any connection issue, then you should change your region into India or for example, into China. I'm not sure what is the reason, what is the issue with the application of uh, Xiaomi, but sometimes it really works to change region to China or uh, India. But if everything is fine, just stay with your normal region, native one, click next and then tap on a device. Now we can add device with scanning or by using scanner. And in this time, you have to also be sure that you turn on Bluetooth. So we can quickly turn it off for a refresh and turn it on. Now go to add device, click agree and accept this permission. Now you should get your Redmi Watch 5 active on the list, but if it is not working, go back and simply repeat. Then uh, you can click on your device. And as you can see right now, we will have to uh, sign in for the Xiaomi account. So click, click here. And you can sign in with your email, phone number, um, Xiaomi account. You can also create account by going uh, right here. Or you can also, let's go back. There we go. Or you can also sign in with your phone number and with Google account. And that's what I'm going to do. So click agree if you are using the same method and select your Google account that you will be using for your application. Now select Redmi Watch 5 Active, uh, 5 Active. Wait for this connection and the pairing. If you have any issue right here and uh, you cannot actually be connected, then simply go back and repeat the process. As you can see, in my case, everything is fine. So I have to click pair on my phone and on my watch. And all we have to do right now is just to wait for this connecting, pairing, and then adding account. As you can see now, we have to actually grant permissions. So click on settings. And now you can just go back, click done, click continue, click next, click next and click done. Now we can mirror phone notifications or we can set uh, the custom one. So that's your choice. In my case, I'm just going to mirror phone notifications, click set. Now we have to locate Mi Fitness and turn on this switcher for notification access. So click set. As you can see, it's right here under not allowed. Tap to allow notification access, scroll down and click allow. Go back. Now uh, you can access for your contacts if you want. So in my case, yes, for sure. Accept permission for calls and for contacts. Right here, we can synchronize the do not disturb mode of your phone. I'm going to do this. Click to turn on automatic synchronization for workouts and fitness data between your watch and phone. Now, as you can see, we already can find new updates. So we can click continue and update right now, or we can do this later. Click that you got it. And uh, as you can see right now, uh, it's actually finished. We can just go for the other tabs and accept everything that pops on the screen. There we go. And now we can just use your device. We are successfully connected and uh, that will be all. Thanks for watching.